shooting outside a Manhattan nightclub early this morning, and police now say they know the identity of the gunman who killed a woman and wounded two others. CBS 2's Matt Kozar has new information in the hunt for the suspect, and he talked with the victim's family. Police say the bullet that struck and killed Waliqua Fawcett outside of a nightclub in the Flatiron District wasn't meant for her. We're broken. I lost, I lost my oldest sister. Prince Fawcett says his 24-year-old sister, who had a three-year-old son, was out celebrating her birthday with friends at Club Motivo on East 21st and Broadway when the shooting happened early this morning. Fawcett's friend, Lauren Rondat, was shot in the foot and hip and is in stable condition. 30-year-old Deborah Raji was shot in the shoulder and is expected to be okay. I just hope he just gets what he deserves. Either by going to jail, or God is going to punish him. Police say the gunman was aiming for the bouncers who tossed him from the nightclub because he'd been fighting. He came back with a gun and fired five shots, but he hit three women standing outside. There were a lot of people actually trying to um, resuscitate one of the females. Cell phone video shows paramedics rushing two of the victims into an ambulance. The shooter is described as a man in his 20s who was wearing a red and black hooded sweatshirt. He fled the scene in a dark colored BMW. That's so sad. She's such a good girl. Fawcett's neighbors say they're shocked at her death. Prince Fawcett says his sister recently got her own apartment and a new car. She worked as a sales associate at Bloomingdale's in White Plains. She was always there for us. Always. Police say they know who the gunman is, but aren't releasing his name because they don't want to tip him off. They say he's a gang member here in the Bronx and has a long rap sheet that includes arrests for a robbery and assault. Reporting in the Williams Bridge section of the Bronx, Matt Kozar, CBS 2 News.